Just as a start, even though we assume that really everyone knows these shortcuts, if you want to copy a text, quickly press CMD and C or Control and C, and paste it with CMD and V or Control and V. So far, so good. By the way, to cut out instead of copying, you can use CMD and X or Control and X. Here are six important hotkeys everyone should know. First up, number six, quick search. Who doesn't know this problem? You search for a specific term on a widespread search engine, and after clicking an interesting result, the relevant text passage is gone. But there's an easy key combination to keep you from long searches and scrolling in the future. If you just quickly press the keys C, M, D, and F, or Control and F, a small box will pop up, which can be used to look for specific words on a website. How useful! Number five, copy the URL. The days of scrolling to the end of long URLs is over. Because the shortcut CMD and L, or Control and L, you'll be able to mark the complete URL in your browser. Then just add a quick copy and paste, and the address has never been sent easier. And number four, marking the entire text. This is particularly useful if you want to quickly mark the entire text in word processing. You don't have to mark everything by hand with your cursor, but instead just press C, M, D, and A, or Control and A. This works over several pages too, which should make marking super long text easier. And the top three, print. Even if the actual printing still remains quite a challenge, the print shop will go really quickly with this shortcut. Because instead of opening the driver first, to then print, open the window with C, M, D, and P, or Control and P. Just adjust a few settings here and there, and the printing can commence. Number two, changing programs. Here's a shortcut that's only relevant for Apple users for a change, but we didn't want to keep it from you, because if you quickly want to switch back and forth between programs, you just have to hold the key CMD and then press Tab. A little window will pop up in the middle of your screen, showing all the open programs. Continue holding CMD and use the Tab button again to get to the next program. This way, you can not only quickly switch between programs, you can close them right away with the key combinations C and D and Q. And number one, call up the desktop. So that Windows users have a little treat too, here's something only for PC. If you don't want to be held up for minimizing all windows, here's an easy way to access the desktop. Really everyone who likes dumping files on his or her desktop should know the key combination Windows key and D, because battling through all open windows to get there can be pretty annoying. Mac users can set the desktop as an active corner, so the desktop will pop up each time you move your cursor over the predefined corner. So guys, we hope we could ease or improve your workflow or lazy flow. If so, leave us a positive review. Other than that, you can watch another video here. As always, we'll see you next time. Stay well and peace out.